Hello everybody, it's Michael Bridget. Pickle Boy here on Bridges Channel to show you a new member of the family. Well, you can't have none of that. So this is Clyde, the new English Bulldog of the He's family. such a cute little baby. He's so much fun. And I think, I think when he gets a little older, he'll be really fun to play with. How do I start? What's going on, you guys? Keep me on the camera here. Bridget was here. It is pretty early in the morning right now. We just got a phone call from Kim. Clyde has passed away while we are here in New York City. Yeah. I didn't get a chance to say goodbye. I know. This is not any kind of like joke. This is not like some like storyline or anything. Clyde's been sick for a long time. Um, just sick in the relative sense that, you know, he's older and his bones are just older. He walks to the door slower and he was starting to go blind in one of his eyes. So we kind of had an idea that it was coming, but I didn't know it would be this soon. I know. I thought we had like another year or two with him. Yeah. But this she called horrible. us and said that uh, he died on the back porch. She was petting him. Yeah, like she was taking them out to go to the bathroom and he just passed away. So we are going home. We're ending the trip early. Um, just, does, just doesn't feel like the right thing to do to be here. I know, I just feel really sad. I know. He was such a good boy. It is, like, you know, he was acting weird last week, and I should have thought. He, like, jumped up in between us on the couch. Yeah, like, several times, and that's really unusual because he's been in so much pain. And, like, he's on medicine, but it's not enough. And he, he did get a lot of love. Just wasn't expecting this to happen. Not why we're on, like, a vacation. You no, know? you know, obviously I figured we'd go home and see all of our dogs and... <sighs> this is so sad. Clyde, we miss you, bud. We love you. I wish I had a chance to say goodbye. I know. You guys, this is not a prank. This is not a joke. We called the pet people and they came and they picked up his body. It's... God damn. Clyde, Clyde has passed away. He is gone. The three amigos are gone. I wanted one last hug. Bella, Lazy, and Clyde, gone. Yeah, what the f- <laughs> We had some good times. It's sad and didn't get to say goodbye to him, you know? Yeah, of course. I said goodbye when we left, but I yeah. didn't know it was going to be for the last time. I know. I'm going to miss him. This sweet little face. He was a good boy. He was. We... We claimed Clyde before he was born. We reached out to the breeder and she let us have first pick. Yeah. And Clyde's mom gave birth to Clyde and we went to the house and we saw his face and we chose him immediately and he was such a good boy. Yeah, he was wonderful. And he was plagued with health problems. Skin issues. His whole life he was just 
paid a lot. Yeah. I took him to the vet, like, every two weeks <laughs> during his best years. Vet bills for Clyde became, like... <laughs> <laughs> it was routine, like it was like the light bill, right? <laughs> yeah, added yeah. to the monthly. <laughs> yeah, cuts. Clyde's vet bills were part of our like yeah. just life. And special food and and daily medicine. And I do it all again. Of course. It sucks. He was a great boy. He was a really good friend. I knew it was coming, so I started giving him special treats. Yeah. Yeah, you know, a year nine in the bulldog life is pretty depressing. Mm -hmm. You just know it's coming, so you feed them. You feed them whatever they want. Clyde, uh, I'm sorry you gotta join the wall. We're running out of room on that thing. I know, man. Dad's there, lazy. We gotta put the Bella picture up now, Clyde. This sucks. This does suck. Clyde, we love you. We're gonna miss you. He was a good boy. He just liked to chill inside in that tent in my office. Mm -hmm. I'd be editing videos and I look out and he's just chilling with his face out. Yeah. And that's gone. So Clyde, I miss you, buddy. Huh? How is he gone? I'm trying to make a joke so you like stop being so sad. It's okay. He's at way better off now. He was in so much pain. He was, it was sad. It was, he, he was blind. He had his skin issues. In a lot of ways, I'm kind of glad we weren't there to find yeah. him like Kim did. Yeah. And I'm really grateful that she was there for him in his last moments. Yeah. I'm just happy he wasn't alone, you know? That's really sad. Yeah. Damn. What's your favorite memory of Clyde? Playing Witcher with him. Yeah. Yeah, that was always the best. You know, like life way before kids, I would just binge games and Clyde was always next to me every step of the way and <laughs> we would just we would just play games. I would, he'd watch. I still remember the day we got him and <laughs> him and Bella were right next to each other and she was so much bigger than he was. Oh I know, it was insane. That picture's still on my Instagram. It's so cute. Rest in peace, boy. And Bella claimed him as like a baby. Yeah. <laughs> she yeah, was yeah. protective and <sighs> they all brought a lot of joy. They're all gone. Oh, yeah, I know, Michael. That's what I Clyde, I'm sorry we weren't there to say goodbye, but I'm glad Kim was there. I'm yeah. glad that you had somebody petting you as you took your last breath. I'm glad that Look, maybe you didn't know we were gone. I remember when we moved houses, it took him like a month to register. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> like, it's a bulldog. Bless their hearts, but it's a bulldog thing. They are dumb animals, you guys. <laughs> they are. He, he, would, he would go to the section of the house where his, we used to have like this kennel that he would go and sit in, and he would go to that part of the house and we're like, it's not there anymore, Clyde. Yeah, like the crate's away and not in that area, honey. <laughs> <laughs> it took like a month. It took a month. <laughs> oh, poor boy. <laughs> Rest in peace, boy. You are, uh... Every time we lose one of these animals, I think of that meme. You know, the where Death is walking with the dog, and I can't even talk about it. And the dog says, was I a good boy? And Death says, no. You were the best. Yeah. Every time we lose one, that's all I think about, because we had such good dogs. Yeah, of course. Our dogs are great. Our kids are great. We have a good life. <laughs> we miss you, Clyde. Miss you, Clyde. We're going to go get some Joe's pizza, and then we're flying home. Oh, well, you ready? Last meal in New York City. Yeah. You good? On the Uber. <laughs> not, not in this Uber. Are we cold? No, we're good. I know. Guys, we're about to have our last meal in New York City. We are going to Joe's Pizza for a slice and then we got a plane to catch. Yeah. This is not how I wanted the trip to end, but it was a good trip. New York, you have been amazing. Food has been amazing. I can't believe this has happened. I know. Really 
thought I'd see him again. He was old. Sometimes it would get to the point where you'd open the back door for him to go outside. It would take him 15 minutes to walk to it, right? Because he was just so tired and rigid. And but He had really bad arthritis. I remember a, uh, a couple of weeks ago, I got McDonald's and I gave him a 20-piece nugget. Yeah, and um, slices of pizza. And People burgers. are going to say that I killed him. <laughs> no, we do it for all of our dogs when they're on, you know, their last years. You know, we, you know, the doctor told us Bella probably wasn't going to make it another three months, and so I made sure it was the best three months of her life. Yo, what is really happening, bro? <laughs> I think like a thousand people just showed up to shows. It shows the best. Well, here it is. Delicious. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> Seriously, what just happened? <laughs> Trying to copy Dave Portnoy or what? He's my freaking idol. You say he's your idol? He's actually mine too because he can eat all the fucking pizza he wants for a living and lose weight. I know, what the hell is that? That's not fair. He's I, my hero. I eat one pepperoni, my ass jiggles for like a month. That sucks. Alright, go ahead. Eat this thing, bro. It's really hot. Burn yourself with a video though. What do you write it? Ten. Ten, come on. Full hot. It's so good. It's my favorite pizza in New York City, I swear. It's the best. I just love it. It's so good. Seriously. Good. Oh, Joe's was good. Joe's was so good, honey. You ready to go? Um, no. No? No, I'm not ready to face reality. Well, we got to. I know. It sucks, I know. It's really just sad. I'm gonna miss New York. I'm gonna miss New York and I'm, I'm sad for Clyde. Well, obviously. You know, I know if we came home, he would do like his little wiggles as much as he could. Goodbye, Hard Rock Hotel. You are absolutely amazing. We are going to miss you. Oh yeah, best amazing. hotel I've ever stayed at. It's a good hotel, it is. Yeah, and everyone's so nice. Yes, thank you, Bridget. Thank you, Michael. It's been a wonderful trip. It has, it's been wonderful. I love spending time with you, you're my best friend. You're my best friend too. <sighs> I'm really going to miss this hotel and the lighting. Oh, this hotel is beautiful. I know. And the guy from Friends. What? Friends. Yeah, on... is that the guy from Friends? He was on Friends? Yeah. What episode? Every episode. Huh? Are you talking about Matthew Perry? Yeah, isn't that him? You think this... Is this? Yeah. That's right? not Matthew Perry. That's Matthew Perry in glasses. Bridget, that's Bruce Springsteen. What? Born in the USA. Oh, God. How could you? Why would Matthew Perry be on our door at the Hard Rock Hotel? I don't know. I figured they were fans. The hotel's got like Rihanna's boobs and Elton John's glasses and yeah. pictures of Bruce Springsteen, not Matthew Perry. <laughs> okay. Did I'm you not find it weird that Matthew Perry was on our door? <laughs> I did. I just didn't know. It's not my design. Oh my God. <laughs> Do you not know who Bruce Springsteen is? I don't. I've heard that song before though. Oh Christ. <laughs> we are leaving the hotel, you guys. Hard Rock. You've been fantastic. Clyde, we're gonna miss you. Yeah, Clyde, I'm gonna miss you a lot. Come on. It's sad, I know. He was a good boy. Oh my love. You're such a fragile thing, I know 
And with the winter comes the ice, the snow. But I'm here at all. And oh my love. About the cold just yet. The trees haven't started to shed. Just feel the summer sun as it warms our bed. Such a fragile thing, I know. And with the winter comes the ice, the snow. But I'm here at all. And oh my love, don't worry about the cold just yet. The trees haven't started to shed. Just feel the summer sun as it warms our bed. And oh my love, the seasons come and they go, but I hope. Okay, got our bags. Got our bags. <sighs> Thank you for the wonderful week, Michael. Thank you for the wonderful week. I had so much fun. All right, you guys, you're checking out. Don't worry, I left money and chocolates over <laughs> there for the housekeeping staff. Those chocolates are actually pretty expensive. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's do it. The nicest hotel I ever stayed in. Like, yeah. I've stayed in a lot of hotels. Okay? <laughs> well, most of them in South Carolina when me and Bridget fight. Oh but... my God, oh, I know. Or you can't like deal with the dolling. Well, what? <laughs> what? I'm going to a hotel. <laughs> we gotta do taxes. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right, dude. I'm done with this bitch. <laughs> She's right, though. For the, re for the record, she is right. No. <sighs> oh, for real, this week has been amazing. Aside from, you know. Oh, yeah. But I had so much fun with you. I did, too. Please. Oh, yeah, we're here. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, no. I gotta take a dump, dude. Dude, you gotta take an airport dump? I got airport anxiety, Bridget. No. <laughs> Where's the food court? Oh, no. Oh, my God. Is there another one? Dude, we're at the restaurant there. I Where's know. the food court? I don't know. Do you have time for whispering? I need an adult to talk to me here. I'm scared. I, I don't know. I'm clenching harder than you know. There's got to be another one. Where? 
probably down there. All the way down there. Dude, that was like two miles away. Bro, like, it's either that or dance, or just go in the women's. No one's gotta know. I'm not looking to get arrested at LaGuardia. <laughs> no one's gotta know. <sighs> Stop. Oh, God. Are you okay? No. Oh, Michael, look. What? Pet relief area. What? Just go there. Okay, so when we go to the section of the airport designated for animals? Yes! There's a bathroom. Holy oh, crap. Oh, my. oh, okay. I'm a human being again. Okay, good. People can hear it, okay? So. Oh my God. Oh, Michael. Okay, great. This is perfect for you. No, nope. You could have squatted right there. I'm getting angry, okay? <laughs> First of all, I don't even want to be in the pet rest area right now. <laughs> oh God, right? That's so sad. Don't start crying at the airport, please. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs>